Hey guys, what's up and welcome to another video on my channel. So today I have two new packs for you guys. It's the Instant Cinematic Filmmakers Pack with 21 Cinematic Layer Lux. You will also get one bonus light in this pack. And I have the Instant Cinematic Basic Pack with three free Cinematic Layer Lux. Once you've downloaded the pack you want, this is what you will get. And you have the adjustment tool to install it, just go ahead and uh, head over to your movies and to your motion templates and just save it in your titles. Make sure to restart Final Cut Pro and then you have, will have the adjustment tool. So let's head over to Final Cut Pro. First of all, take the adjustment uh, tool and drag it over your clips. Like that. And then head over to the effects, effects and press the color one and choose the custom LUT and drag it on top and then go ahead and load the LUT so choose custom LUT then you just load each of these uh, folders to Final Cut Pro and you go ahead and just add one Let's see what it does see it gives a cinematic look but these are made to use on top of other LUTs so go ahead and add uh, one of your other LUTs for example you can choose one of my LUTs from my other LUT pack or you can go ahead and choose the bonus LUT if you downloaded the Filmmakers pack. So I'm going to go ahead and choose uh, vlog LUT number 6 which is free download and I'm going to go ahead and take it up to 60% I think it looks quite nice then. To make it even more, you see before and after here as well. But to make it even more cinematic, go ahead and drag another custom LUT uh, effect in and you go ahead and add, for example, the cinematic LUT layer dark. And you see it gives it a more cinematic look. But I wouldn't have it on 100%, I would have it maybe on 0.5. The more shadows, more blue shadows in your shot, just add the blue shadow one and you'll see it adds a nice blue, adds on nice blue shadows to your shot. You can test out the layer, the light layer. You check out the cinematic light layer light with uh, some orange and teal, with a hint of orange and teal in it. And we can check out the normal cinematic light layer. There we have it. Add the light layer dark with some orange highlights. The light layer light with blue shadows. The orange and blue, orange highlights with the dark one orange shadows. For this one I would maybe go for the blue cinematic layer dark with some blue shadows and maybe use it on 0.4 see without. It looks more cinematic with the cinematic look layer. So go and to make it even more cinematic you can uh, just head over here and you add the letter box effect to your adjustment tool and you go ahead and press 2.35 and then you get the nice letterbox effect which you see in most uh, cinematic movies so yeah hope you guys enjoy this video and if you did make sure to leave it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new and i'll see you guys in the next one peace